<clears throat> hey what's up YouTubers, John Rambo. Uh, today I want to show you uh, what the military, is, the bags the military is currently using. Uh, I'm kind of doing this in a response to Cav at, or Kevin at survivalsports.com and I wasn't sure how many people would be interested in this but I thought I'd show it anyway but uh, we'll start we're, in the rifleman's kit you're actually issued two bags now this one is known we call it the large or we just call it the ruck large ruck uh, and the tag inside says molly 2 large ruck we just call this one the ruck sack uh, this one we call the assault pack and uh, we'll get into it a little bit uh, when I was in Iraq I don't know that I ever used this thing this is just pretty much something if you're going for an extended amount of time like a week or more you might want to take this because I was mobilized <laughs> I was mobile uh, driving trucks uh, I always use the assault pack I was only most of the time I was only out for a couple of days so most of the time I just use this the assault pack here um, I do like this, but it's like I say, it's very rare that I'd ever use it. Uh, it has a, a frame. The frame is plastic and will not break. It flexes, so you can see that there. And it has a, of course, the, the old kidney pad belt. And turn it over. Uh, our technology in the army has come a long way since I've been in but so you got on the outside here you got a compartment in the bottom which is really cool I mean you keep part of your sleep system in here keep your sleep system in here and then you got another large compartment up here and you got a zipper in the bottom there's a zipper you can open it up if you need if you need a bigger compartment and it also when you get it because of two large pockets on the side two large pouches on the side so pretty neat system I just then you got a I guess a what do you call a map case or something here in the flat you can keep extra stuff pretty neat pretty nice system I don't have the OCPs if you hear me say OCP, it's the uh, Ar Army's version of multicam. So, and like I say, this is the smaller assault pack, about, about uh, probably 75 to 90 percent of the time. This is probably what you'd actually use. It does, it's got a it's got like a, a kidney belt but not the pad no padding on it it's not very big it's got like a plastic I guess that's like the frame it's got styrofoam in it too to help pad your back this is the large compartment you have a small compartment here on the outside and another one right here got a bunch of change in it I think there's another one right here on the inside, a little flat. But yeah, about probably 75, 90 percent of the time, this is what you would use in a salt pack. And of course, you got room for molly uh, pouches on the side. You got a bunch of room for molly pouches on this, but you have to remember uh, the old pounds equal pain philosophy. It is very true. <laughs> it really exists. People think you can load this thing up and just go anywhere, you know, carry it. You ain't gonna get very far if this thing's loaded. I mean, that's just the nature of the beast. I don't care how big and bad you think you are. Anyway, this is John Rambo, and I'm out.